Very good morning students. In the last class, we have discussed about the various parts of the computer used to form it. They were, they were input devices, processing devices, output devices and storage devices. We already discussed how these four parts work together to perform a computer system's work. And finally, we came to know what is data and what is information. But today, we will learn some more of these input devices apart from the mouse and the keyboard. The first one is joystick. This joystick is one of the input devices that is used to play video games. As some of you might have seen these joysticks. These are these are one of the in, uh, input devices we use it to play video games. And after this joystick, there is a light pane. There is the light pane. Children, light pen means it's a digital pen. Here I am using this pen to write on this whiteboard. You are using the ball pen to write on your notebook. But in computer, it uses a digital pen by using which we can write on the digital boards only. The, this light pen is used to write something by using the digital board. Now, the third one is microphone. The third one is children. I think all of you have seen these microphones because during the school's assembly. Most of uh, some of you are conducting the assembly by using these microphones. The C here, I am also using one microphone to prepare this video. The, this microphone, what it does, it takes our voice into the computer system. Did you understand what is microphone? Okay, now, now the last one is scanner. The fourth one is scanner. Students, scanner means this one is a flat shaped object that is used to scan our photos or images into the computer system. So this, this is one of the input devices and what it does it scans, which means it takes our photos and our any image inside the computers. Now, children, the other use of these four input devices clear to you? Okay. Now proceed to the proceed to the next part. First, now we will study about the processing. Hardware, these were the input hardware. Now we will learn about the processing devices. Now the processing devices. Children, you already know the brain of a computer from standard one class. Do you know? What is the brain of a computer system? It is the CPU. CPU stands for Central Processing Unit. And here today we will learn about the various parts of a CPU. The CPU is made of three different types. One is called ALU. And the next one is called AMU, and the final, the last one is called CEU. 
The CPU is the brain of a computer. The brain means why the CPU is called the brain of a computer, do you know? As human being, our brain controls each of the organs. Yes or no? Like that, CPU controls all its hardware devices. That is why we will say this processor is the brain of a computer. And this CPU again divided into three different types. ALE, it stands for arithmetic, logic, unit. That means here all the calculations are performed. And after this ALU, what is this? This is called MEU. This MEU stands for memory unit and this stores the data and information. And CEU, it controls and it stands for control unit. It does all the calculations here. Children, did you understand today the different parts of a CPU and why this CPU is called as the brain of any computer system? Okay, children, this much for you today. And before finishing my class, I want to ask you some questions. From today's class, what did we learn? So now I am giving you something to write. First, you write the use of the following devices. Write joystick, microphone, light pen, and scanner. You write the use for each of these input hardware. And after writing it, Next question is you. Next question for you is why, why the CPU is called as the brain of a computer? Did you write why the CPU is called as the brain of a computer? Okay, now next question What are the different parts of a CPU? Did you write children? And now write the uses of ALU. Sorry, write the roles of ALU, MU, and CU. Role means what they do. Okay, children, this must for today, and in the next class. We will do a small test what we learnt from these classes. Thank you.